Hey there, it's Rob Keating. You may be wondering what March 9, 2003 is all about, but more on that later. As you probably know, it's NBA Finals time and the Chicago Bulls are one on one with the Brooklyn Nets after a great game two in Brooklyn. Plenty of energy by Joachim Noah helped get the team that win, which was vital on the road. Now the series heads back to Chicago today. As you can see, I'm a bit of a Chicago fan, having followed them since the early 80s. The reason why is I am a Taurus and I just love the logo and I just happened to hook up with the Bulls. And then MJ came along and you all know about Michael Jordan and the Chicago Bulls and what happened once he hit the team and the rest is history. Just happened to be lucky enough to have that team as one I follow. It was a great time. Also, Luke Longley played for the Bulls and being an Aussie, it was great to follow him and Luke Sencher, who unfortunately didn't have the same success as the other Luke from Australia. But anyway, March 9, 2003, what's that all about? That was the day Derek Rose was cleared to make his comeback to the NBA. But we haven't seen him on the court just yet, at least not in his game suit or already play. He's been out there practicing, teasing the fans. He's been in the Chicago practice facility playing full contact training, yet D. Rose still hasn't come back. He's right to go physically, he's been cleared, but mentally he's just not there. As an ex-NBA, I'm not an NBA player, I wish I was, as an ex-Pro Beach volleyball player who's had injuries to deal with, I know how it is. I had tendonitis in my shoulder and a few times I came back too soon and I was out even longer than the first time I had to rest. So it's a real bummer when that sort of thing happens and you love the sport, you want to get out there but you're injured and you don't manage the injuries properly and then it gets to you mentally. You're a bit tentative when you come back. So D Rose, I know how you feel man, but there's Chicago fans around the world, we want to see you out on the court. You on the court with the Bulls, there's a chance for an NBA championship, but maybe that's going to have to wait until next season. Because the way things are, D Rose just doesn't look like getting back out onto the court. It would be a great thing to have him there. And who knows how far the Bulls could go. Last year they were tipped to go all the way, but then unfortunately we saw what happened. Almost a year to the day now, he fell to the court, clutching his knee after the Chicago Bulls had pretty much put the Philadelphia 76ers away for the night. He should have been off the court, and who knows what would have happened. But it's all great to look back in hindsight. You never know what might have happened if he was off the court. He could have done it next game. He may never have done it. But anyway, it happened, and the guy has dealt with it. He's put in a ton of work to get back on the court. He's been practicing and practicing, dunking, shooting, full contact, but he's still not ready to go into the games. So come on D-Rose, make up your mind, either say you're not going to play at all this season or get back out there and start playing. The Bulls watch it. So Game 3 is coming up tonight, looking forward to it, watching it here in Australia. So this is Rob Keating saying, come on Derek, I want to see you play. Hope you all have a great day.